Oke, okay. oke, okay, bismillah. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Oke, okay. welcome back to another COTD. Now I'm gonna be your teacher, guys. Yeah. And now we're gonna learn about the biomes. We're gonna learn biomes. So, what is a biome? I know. Biome is a region that shares a common geographic or climatic properties and includes communities of plants, animals, soil and organism, bacteria and viruses. The scope of a biome includes a several ecosystem with a l large regional elements and its and is distinct from the biosphere from the wikipedia so yeah first the lesson outline so we're gonna define what is a biome and the major biomes of the world describe the unique characteristic and the condition of the biome compare the contrast of the plant and the animal life found in the different biomes okay group activities on the left are some diverse animal brainstorm with your group and classify this animal according to the thing. okay system and like a system it can be divided as a group of a both living and non-living organism that interact with one another in a specific environment this is intricate system is characterized by interdependence among organisms such as animals plants and microorganisms who rely on each other on the surroundings condition for survival okay, next so yeah this is what is biome beyond me prefer fast to general okay let's next so first biome is called the forest the forest biome which covers about 30 percent of the earth land surface is incredibly fast and varied these large areas of land are primarily made up for, of trees and other wood vegetation the forest biome falls into three main classifications, and that is tropical forest, temperate forest, and boreal forest. Flora and fauna of the forest. First, there is giant sequoia, bird tree, bear, snake, and continental rabbit, and hicks you. Next, the second biome, and that is tundra. The tundra biome, which is predominantly located in Canada, Alaska, Russia, North, and yeah, it's northmost region. It's a wide expanse of land with no trees. It has a cold environment known for its extended winter season and brief summer periods. The flora and fauna of tundra. First there is snow leopard, yellow-eyed penguin, snowy oak. Snowy owl, Arctic poppy, cotton grass, and Arctic moss. Moss, yeah. The third one, desert. The desert biome is a dry, arid region that receives less than 10 inches of rain rainfall per year. Desert biome has extreme temperature, and yeah, with hot days and cold nights. This desert desert are found all over the world. From the Sahara in Africa to Moldova in the United States to the Gobi in Asia. The flora and fauna of the desert. There is a gua cactus, bacterian camel, pear cactus, fox, tiger rattlesnake, and then foxtail. Yeah, that thing. Third one, aquatic. The aquatic biome is a vast eco ecosystem that covers approximately 70% of the Earth's surface. It is a home to a wide variety of plant and animal species, many of which are adapted to live in the water. The aquatic biome includes both a freshwater and saltwater <coughs> environments, ranging from, from rivers and lakes to ocean and coral reefs. The flora and fauna of the aqu yeah, aquatic. There is a shark, a sea turtle, sea turtle, jellyfish, soft coral, hydro coral, and starfish. It's just this is just one of the example that I show you. The 
Next one, the fifth one, the grassland biome, also known as prairies, steeps, or savannas, depending on the region. It's a type of ecosystem characterized by vast expanse of grasses and occasional trees. Grasslands are typically located in areas with semi-arid or condition of climate. Okay. Flora and fauna of the grassland. There is baobab, baryap, ostrich, and an ostrich bird, bird. Yeah, like the egg is good. And there's lion, elephant, grass, armadillo, and fence lizard. So, why are biomes important? Biomes are home to a wide variety of plant and animal species, many of which are found nowhere else on Earth. The, this biodiversity is important for maintaining the health of ecosystem and for providing important ecosystem services, such as pollution and uh, cycling. Number one, the number two, biomes play an important role in regulating the Earth's climate with plants absorbing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and re releasing oxygen. This helps to mitigate the effects of climate change and keep the planet's climate system in balance. Three, biomes provide important resources for human use such as food, timber and medical plants. Many traditional cultures also rely on biomes for culture and spiritual practices. Okay, don't... Yeah, just remove the... Okay. Biomes are also provide opportunities for recreation and tourism such as hiking, camping, and wildlife watching. The fourth, biomes helps to regulate the water cycle by storing and releasing water which is important for maintaining freshwater resources and preventing flooding and drought. Biomes help to maintain soil fertility by cycling nutrients and providing organic matter. Yeah, so do you learn about the so you learn about the different types of biomes and the flora fauna that I that live in each this biome. Identify, classify the flora fauna at the bottom according to the use okay according to the volumes use the tables of the next one okay before we go okay now i'm gonna give you guys some question and yeah so like this animal live in where this animal live in where and this animal live in where okay ah Correct. so where ah, this this animal where did he live what biome Ah, you don't listen, listen, huh? You don't. What is this animal? Tell me. Ah, you need to listen when I am teaching. So this called armadillo. Yeah, the he lives, he lives in the grass. No, yeah, grassland. Yes, it's grassland. And now next, dadan. Where's dadan? Oh, there's no dadan. Irja. How about? Hmm, this one. What biome did this know, animal lift? I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. Okay, only half right is actually aquatic. Yeah, like that. I don't know lah. Okay, good, good, good. I guess that is it. And then now, ah, tell me, ah, ah. what is this ah. biome called? Ah, what is? Okay, good. Tarik, okay. one point. And what is this? Desert, desert. Okay, ah, what is this? Ocean. Ah, what's the name? Ya? Aquatic, 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 aquatic. Aquatic. Okay, good. And what is this? Grassland. Uh, Grassland. Okay, good. And what is this? No. Okay, good, Kenzie. Okay. Biomes not only broaden our understanding of the world, but also help us appreciate the relationships among all organisms. Thank you for listening. This is Science with Science with Kenza. Okay? Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Ini sih sempet ya? Eh, already, Mister. Ini sudah 3 menit, bro. Sudah 3 menit, tak kalah.